Welcome back to Ed Hunts. So today, we're back at the boot fairs. As you can see, it's a beautiful morning. Currently in the middle of a drought uh, here in London. And yeah, you can see that the ground is particularly yellow. And today I am back with a regular boot fair hunter. Someone who hasn't been on the channel for a good few months now. Ladies and gentlemen. Bro and Ben. How we doing? Right. <laughs> right. And uh, yeah, it's uh, it's Ben's birthday today. Tomorrow. So, um, well, it's his birthday weekend. So uh, yeah, might even. Uh, well, I gave him some stuff earlier. Maybe we'll go through his pickups later, and you'll see what I got him. And uh, yeah, we'll get in there and we'll see what we can find. It looks quite busy, so hopefully we'll find some good bits. So. So you love a dinosaur. Oh, I think he's selling. Yeah, that's what I mean. Get rid of the newest. Well, I'm I'm doing, are you alright? Alright? Yeah, not too bad. Like, Is it your stall? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Us, and I yeah. never saw you. Never ever saw you. Oh, there you go. Yeah, now. Like, that's him. Oh, no, that's him. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> I remember these. <laughs> are you, how, many, how much are you games? Grand each. Um, there might be, but we'll see the mirror. It's only a bit of um, costume jewelry in there. No, Yeah, I'll have that one, please. Retro collector balls. Shattered, it's been early start. Cheers, mate. Yeah, mate. Much appreciated. That's alright, mate. Good, good. Any tip, any tip guides? No. Oh, you got the Shiva. Did you get this recently? Yeah, you yeah. know why? Because I'm just not going to, I know I'm not going to watch it. I did, I don't. How much more for it? No, take it. Take it? Yeah, yeah, take it. Sweet. It's my sister. Yeah, because she fucking loves Shiva. I am Shiva. And I was like, oh, I don't know if I want, I want to share a movie with him, man. Oh, is this like episodes? I think it's episodes, yeah. Right, right, right. Mm -hmm. It's your song, mate. Yeah, mate. How much of the game? Found each, mate. Found each. No worries, sir. Cheers. That quid as well? Two quid, mate, eh? Oh, two quid. In a box? Yeah, yeah, I'll bet. I won't. <laughs> <laughs> are they taken? Oh. How much are they? Uh, they're all empty. All right, mate, I've got a fiver's worth there. Yeah, cool, mate. Ooh, okay. It's not too bad. Don't forget. Change the case. Yeah, change the Yeah, oh yeah, easy. You know, you know everyone's got spares, so... That wasn't too bad either, actually. Yeah. Harry Potter's always worth getting, you know. It's in there. Uh, wasn't in there. How much are your games, mate? Right? Uh, they're all priced. Oh, they're all pretty priced. Yeah, yeah, go on. Yeah. 
What else you got? I'm having a clear out. Okay. Sealed? Yeah. Got around and played them. Ooh. Drink. I'll take those pieces, mate. Yeah. Hey, my man. These are his pieces. Well, go on, brother. Oh, He's got a few uh, bits and bobs for me. Ooh. Yeah, I told you it was cases. Oh, it? yeah. But... Yeah. But there are some loose games in there as well. Uh... Oh, right. Oh, 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 oh. What are you looking at? Well, a whole lot. What are uh, you interested in? There's some more there as well. Oh, the six button pad? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, I don't want those. I've no, seen them ones already, yeah? Yeah. Definitely want. Definitely want. All this though. Well, you've got two empty cases, quid each on them. Yeah. Uh, ten, all in, everything. For you, Bob, are you? Yeah, yeah, sweet, Bob. Oh, we've got a few uh, classic VHSs. Yeah. Check this in, sweet little deal? Yeah, got one. Yeah, sweet. <laughs> Right, we are at boot fan number two. Uh, boot fan number one was very competitive. Uh, we did get a few bits and bobs, but nothing like spectacular. Uh, so yeah, come to the next one, so we can get. How much is inside that? Uh, about eight pounds. Eight pounds. How much that was? Two quid. You take two for that? I'll do two fifty. Yeah. There you go, I was on about PS1, uh, PSP going. Did it for 150? Yeah, one Yeah. How many shooting games? Three pounds. Three pounds each. It's all paints, that. Cool. Cheers, thanks, that. You know, they don't want to pay like five pounds. They don't want to pay a lot of money. So we're with Bargain Ben. We're going to check out his pickups. So we've got Time Crisis 3. I like Burner. chucking them in the front. Yeah, most of these were a couple of quid or a pound, 50p. Star Wars Knights Republic, Breath of Thought O, PS1, nice. Snatch on UMD, Midnight Club, PSP, dropped them for a bit. Hot, yeah, Need for Speed, Black Ops, I've got that today as well. Smackdown vs. World 2010, Red Dead 2, to the, the Darkness. Uh, Raw 2, which I thought would chop in for a bit more than two quid, but there you go. And Ferrari Challenge, and you've got a few other bits and bobs from this boot fair. And that's uh, yeah, plug and play, third party, third party, cool baby. Late has it set. Oh, nice, and you see, you get that one. Two quid. Oh, yeah. nice. Walkers oh, as well. Uh, well yeah, we're going to get out of that Xbox 360 game, yeah. Okay, Star Wars Super Bombard. 
Star Wars Race for Revenge, two quid trading on that. Tomb Raider Underworld. Silent Hill Homecoming, that's a £10 trading, £2 pay for that. Great pickup. And then Batman Arkham Knight. A few other bits and bobs. Star Wars 3 Lego. Oh. And then we got Turtles Wallet, pound. I actually spotted that. And we're back. So, just got back from the boot fairs, and yeah, today was actually quite tough. Um, the first boot fair we went to, we didn't get there that late, I would say. I would say probably like, you know, a reasonable time. And it was already completely full of buyers. Um, there was quite a few sellers there as well, but, and there was quite a few sellers coming in as we got there as well. So I was able to get to some stores before other people. Um, however, it just wasn't like the greatest day of pickups. I did do okay though, like don't get me wrong, it was alright. And because it was just so hot, like sometimes I just forgot to press the record button. And um, so I didn't get everything that I got on camera. However, like some of it, you know, it's not fantastic. So it doesn't really matter too much. But yeah, let's get into the pickups. Now, first I'm going to go through uh, a little bundle that I got off uh, Pizarro's Pieces, who was uh, stalling out. So yeah, big up Pizarro. Much appreciate the deal that you gave me, so I'm going to show you the bits and bobs now. So the first thing I've got is a Mega Drive uh, pad by a Sick Button. Now, I don't have any of these Six Button pads, and they're quite hard to come across. This is in very nice condition as well, like, works absolutely great, like, looks very clean. And uh, yeah, I'm going to keep this and put it as part of the collection because, yeah, I don't have one, and these are really good for uh, fighting games on the Mega Drive. So, like, you know, your Mortal Kombat, Street Fighters, Tunnel, um, Tunnel Champions, stuff like that. So, yeah, really, really appreciate that. Cheers, Tom. Thank you very much. Uh, then, part of this bundle, we've got some DS stuff. Now, we've got Pokemon Moon here. Now, fortunately, the game is not in there, it's just an empty case. That's all right because find loose games all the time so Pokemon Moon empty case then we've got Mario Kart DS again this is an empty case um, I've actually got a few of these now but I think they're American so it's nice to have an English one in case I find a, a loose cart and then we've got two games which is uh, Sonic Chronicles on the DS and we've got Super Mario Bros on the DS as well and we've got one more thing from Tom as well which is Biker Mice from Mars VHS tape so what do you say doll want to watch me stump some goons now, I think this is just a few episodes. Yeah, just a few episodes, not the film or anything like that. But yeah, it's really cool. And all of that was £10. So yeah, I thought that was a really great deal. So thank you very much, Tom. Really appreciate it. All the rest of the stuff that I've got came to £13. Everything. So if you look at it like that, the pickups aren't actually that bad. So let's get into it. And uh, yeah, sure we got. So we've got Garfield's Nightmare on the DS. Now, this is one I've never really seen before. Um, it doesn't have its manual, I'm not sure if it comes with one, but um, yeah, I thought for a quid, there you go. Then we've got Professor Layton and Pandora, Pandora's box, now this is sealed. Um, this was £2.50, got it off a couple that had like a little pile of DS games, this was kind of like at the bottom, so like, I'm kind of glad I went for it now because it looks like everyone else missed it, because uh, it was a stall that had been there for a while as well, so yeah, really happy to get that, that's worth about 15 I think, sealed. Uh, this is one to avoid. If you ever see this out in the world and you're looking to exchange, don't buy this game. Call of Duty Black Ops on the PS3. Um, now the reason why I bought it because there is one Call of Duty game on the PS3 that goes for good money, but I just don't know which one it is. Uh, it's not this one. So avoid getting Call of Duty Black Ops if you're looking to exchange at CEX. Uh, then we've got Super Monkey Ball Banana Blitz. Now I don't think I've got this on camera. This is um, the seller actually had all of his games were very nice condition. He had loads of sealed games as well. Um, but they were all like, you know, Wii, PlayStation 3, you know, nothing like retro. So, um, yeah, Super Monkey Ball, Banana Blitz. Uh, then we've got Sonic Heroes on the PS2. I think that was 50p. Uh, Tokyo Extreme Racer, again 50p. Uh, got Tetris Worlds, I think that was 50p as well. Uh, we've got a few PSP games here. Uh, Splinter Cell Essentials. And we've got Tomb Raider Legend. Now it's not in the greatest condition. This doesn't have its manual either, but the game is in there. So I can replace the case on that. Then we've got a bunch of uh, Just Dance games. Now I've got, I know I've got these all 50p each. Uh, it's Just Dance 1. And we've got Just Dance 2. And we've got Just Dance 4. Now this is this is a good one for uh, trading. The other two, not so much. I think they're only trading for like, 
<laughs> next to nothing basically. Then we've got uh, Super Fruitful, which is a pound. Again, it's from that same seller that had the really nice condition uh, Wii and PS3 games. And yeah, all these are like mint, like honestly, like, it doesn't even look like the games in play, but absolutely fantastic condition. Uh, then we've got WarioWare Smooth Moves, again from the same setup. Again, doesn't have its manual, but it's in very nice condition nonetheless. Uh, we've got Rayman Raving Rabbids 2. I've recently got the first one of this as well, so now I've got both. I think there's a third one as well, actually. So, or maybe even there's four. Uh, then we've got Rooms on the DS. I believe this is a pound as well. This is all from the second boot fair as well, that we went to, looks from the first one. And we've got Sims 2 Pets. Again, I think it's a pound. Chops in for like 150, so not the greatest trading, but yeah, whatever. Then we've got a uh, Championship Bass on the PS1. Now, I know this was a pound. This is complete. It's a PS1 game I've never really seen before, so yeah, I was quite happy to pick that one up. And I do like my fishing games. I don't actually like fishing in real life, but the simulators are really good, especially like get bass on the uh, on the Dreamcast. Uh, then we've got Nintendo Dogs, Labrador and Friends. Again, always, if you ever see a Nintendo Dogs game, just buy it if it's less than two pounds, because they always trade in for at least four or five. So always pick up these Nintendo Dogs games. Then we've got a DVD here. We've got um, Robocop, the Prime Directives. Now, the geezer actually said he wanted his like, free for a pound on DVDs, and this was included, so I was just like, you know what, can we take 50p for this? And he was like, yep, yeah. so got 50p, thought it was quite good. And then, last, of, last and least, we got a uh, unofficial PS3 DualShock controller. Um, yeah, I think this was like two pounds, so yeah, not too bad. So yeah, that's all my pickups for the day, and um, yeah, I've also sorted out a bargain memory with a few Mega Drive games for his birthday as well, you know what I mean, but we done. And um, yeah, just want to say, like, Thanks to everybody who's been uh, liking and subscribing to the videos recently. Really, really means a lot. If you haven't done already, please do hit that like and subscribe button. It really does help the channel. It really does help boost everything up and it really helps uh, me create better content as well because I'm able to have better resources in order to make content. So, <laughs> yeah, again, hit that like button, consider subscribing and I'll see you in the next one.